I'm Chef Jasper from Hen House Markets. Today we're making an authentic New England lobster roll. Absolutely delicious. We start off with a whole lobster. We drop it in boiling water. We let it sit and cook for a little bit. We take it out and we drain it, of course. We bring it over to our cutting board. And I have a little trick I think you'll like. We hold the lobster, the body, and then we get the tail and we twist it off. It's not that difficult. Just make sure you cool down the lobster a little bit. And all you do is you just twist it just like this. And there you have the tail. All right, to cut the tail now, we kind of open this up a little bit, just like this right here. Kind of smash it down a little bit and crack it. And now get your knife and run it right along the back. And there we have it. One nice clean cut right down the middle. We open this up and then we have all this beautiful lobster meat. So succulent. All right, we also have these claws to deal with. Same thing, just break them apart. And again, we'll give it a nice crack. We'll open them up and the meat will just come right out. All right, so we get most of our meat here and then we're gonna to need to cut this up. So we'll cut up as much as we can. We'll place this all in a bowl and we'll let it sit in the refrigerator and let it cool for about an hour to an hour and a half. So the lobster has been chilling and now we'll add a little bit of mayonnaise, of course, some scallions, some chopped celery for a little crunch. Of course, a pinch of sea salt and some cracked black pepper. That's all you have to do for the lobster salad filling. We'll mix this up. And again, I like to chill this for another 15 or 20 minutes before I put on the buttered buns. All we need to do now is just butter the bun just a little bit. Oh, come on, a little more is not gonna hurt. We'll put that in the pan and we'll let that toast just for about 30 to 45 seconds. And now to assemble the lobster roll, all you do is put that chilled lobster salad right on top of those toasted buns. It is such a delicious recipe. I'm sure the whole family is going to enjoy it. It's a traditional New England lobster roll recipe. Traditional New England restaurants serve lobster rolls with potato chips on the side. The lobster roll was first originated at a restaurant named Perry's in Milford, Connecticut back in 1929.